There's a devil in the bottle Staring straight at me Dare I me to reach out But I know he's testing me If I take just one sip I become that devil son Okay, time for another beer review. Uh, this time it's Nelson's Admiral Pow Ow from Harry Brew. Um, looking forward to this one. Got obviously connection because uh, Nelson and HMS Victory, the oldest warship that's still in commission, by the way. Hence it keeps the HMS title. Uh, obviously based in Portsmouth. You got HMS Warrior or SS Warrior it is and the uh, Mary Rose all in the same museum. So if you're down this way, it's worth going. It's a little pricey, but it is really worth going. Um, and yeah, it's time to crack the beer. Not much heat, but a little smoke is there. Well, that is a lovely looking pint in it. Good head on it. Two fingers in it. Well carbonated as you can see. Straight out of the fridge so a little chill haze I bet. But it's uh, a lovely colour. It's gold and amber, that is. <sighs> now the aroma. You get a little bit of breadiness. And then you get this hops. The hops are coming through. Quite sweet. Not much more than that. I'm diving. Oh. Um, slight citric taste. Bready. Slightly bready. The malts. Um, Yeah, it's quite a. Let me get the malts. It's quite a fruity flavour. Um, I've not used Nelson's um, hops before. Quite sweet. Um, I would say that's like a, a very golden braggot. Um, it's got a very sweet taste to it. Oh, it's quite sweet. It's uh, got a sweetness to it. Hot fire. Hot profile's getting bigger now because the head's gone down. It's obviously starting to warm up a bit. So I'm going to let that sit for a while. Let it warm up a bit to get more of the hot profile. Right, well I've let it sit for five minutes. So and you get definitely get more aroma on it. So at least uh, I'd bring this out 10-15 minutes before you use it. Um so we're gonna have another sniff. Much more aroma off it now. Um Initially it's grassy, you get that grassy hoppage aroma. But mixed in with it is a fruitiness. Um, the 
it's slightly citrusy. Not like an orange or a lemon, not like citra. Um, not like uh, your lemons or oranges, it's not that, that type of citra. It's more of your softer fruits. I would say peach. I would go for more uh, your softer fruits, but more of your tropical ones, you know. Um, it's starting to fade again. So I'm going to dive in again and have another taste. Well, much more flavour. Um, I should have let this come out, but I've been working on it out in the back, so I'm a bit thirsty. Um, you get initially that pungent, hot grassiness. And that fades, but you get a sweetness of um, not as like tropical fruit. Uh, yeah, I would term it as a um, slightly grapeish um, passion fruit, maybe. That in that area of sweetness and in, in that in flavour. Um, and you get the malts as well, so it's a very nice uh, combination. Um, I'll have to uh, play around with some of these. This um, Nelson Selvin is a New Zealand hop. I know that, and I know it's called Nelson from the area where it's um, grown. And the Selvin bit is actually because it's a very grape like Selvin, uh, Savion Blanc, Savion Blanc uh, grape. I know that, that's all I know about the grape, uh, about the hop rather. Um, but yeah, that's uh, it's crisp, it's very crisp on the, on the on this beer is very crisp. You get that grassy, earthy, meadow. That's what it's like. It's like a meadow. You have that in, 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 say, a meadow in June. You have that grassiness, but then you have the floral, sweet floral background. Um, and then there's the bitter in afterwards. Um, but you get this lingering fruitiness um, of a soft tropical fruit. I would say it's uh, trying to think mango passion fruit it's a really nice combination it's a really nice L this one it's 4.5 pardon me it's carbonated still it's still got a look lacing on the jar um, and it's still got its aroma For a high alpha hop, it's not over pungent. There's more flavour rather than just that hot oil pungency. Um, yeah, it's a really good beer. Cheers, Harry. Um, I'll tell you what, if Admiral Nelson was putting a barrel of this instead of a barrel of brandy when he embalmed his body to come back, he'd have had a good drink in his afterlife, wouldn't he? This is a really good beer. Um, Thanks a lot, and yeah, definitely one for me to try, that hop. Um, definitely one to go for. Right, so we'll start me all grains again, because um, the mead situation, the honey and all that's all put away for a couple of different special meads that I'm going to do, so definitely going to start some all grains again. But this is a very nice beer. Thank you very much, Harry. Cheers, and here's to the next review. Thank <laughs> you.